I picked him up and we went to IHOP. And then the guy brings the bill and I give him my credit card and he goes, okay, I need an ID for that. And I go, yeah, no problem. Uh, I only have my passport because I just flew in from Canada. And he said, we don't take those. And I said, yep, you do. And he said, I need a driver's license. And I said, that is a passport. And he said, I need a state-issued ID. And I said, have you heard of the states that have become united? Because there are 50 of them, and they all got together and made me that book. That's like 49 extra driver's licenses. As a matter of fact, if you handed me your driver's license, I would use it as a bookmark in my passport. And he grabbed it and threw it into my lap, and he goes, that's an ID to travel around the world. And my daughter goes, isn't this the International House of Pancake? I found out later she was trying to reason with this guy and be on my team. Ripped them off her face and just been like, sir, does it not make sense that a passport made by these United States of America would be a sufficient form of identification at the International House of Pancakes? Case dismissed. The manager comes over, he goes, uh, hey, just so you know, we do take passports here. And I go, yep, we know that. And I go, maybe you should head on back to the kitchen and WikiLeak that to your team. Because I think that's where the problem lies. So the manager walked away, and the waiter walked away, and my son, he goes, hey, next time we have that guy as a waiter, we should pay with $2 bills and watch him shit his pants. 